What's up, trendsetter kings and queens? Stick around, let's chill and spill some trending tea. Trending today is Nicki Minaj. Media Takeout made a huge announcement yesterday claiming they have sources connected to Nicki Minaj. I don't know if y'all noticed, but Nicki Minaj has pretty much ghosted the public and hasn't posted anything since November 13th, 2022 on her Instagram. Many were speculating maybe she was having surgery. Some say that she was taking a social media hiatus because of all the drama with Lotto, you know, and the chaos with the green that was going out with her not being in the rap category with Super Freaky Girl and that it got moved to the pop category with Taylor Swift. Others are speculating the queen herself is pregnant and is planning on announcing her pregnancy at the Grammys. Now the Grammys are due to air this Sunday, February 5th, but y'all, I'm not really sure about all this. I haven't been, you know, completely sold on it because these rumors have been going around since last year. Now Media Takeout says they spoke to a person close to Nikki who tells them that the legendary hip-hop artist plans to announce her pregnancy to the world at the Grammys. Now, could she be pregnant? Well, sure, of course, y'all, she can, but she could be, you know, out of the public eye for many other reasons also. But I'm too excited, though, for real, because, honey, if she comes out with that big old belly, y'all, then we gonna know the rumors are true. Because, for real, y'all know that she likes to move in silent, and so I'm not 100% convinced that she's gonna announce it at the Grammys, but let me know in the comments below if you think Nikki is pregnant y'all and y'all don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe because you know your girl is trying to get over a thousand subscribers so we can go live with you all and bring you the trending hot tea babes come on hit the like hit the subscribe and support your girl up next is another queen of ours Beyonce has had a roller coaster of a time in the news lately everyone seems to be coming for her first of all she does her first public event in Dubai in four years and people were not happy because she performed in a country that does not support the LGBTQ plus community when Beyonce says she supports them. And then it's her alleged old bodyguard coming out talking mad crazy about her relationship with Jay-Z, saying it's just a business relationship, and then also making mad accusations that Beyonce was also on drugs. And now there's another lady coming out saying that she allegedly was told that her friend was with Beyonce and her team at dinner and that Beyonce was having trouble with the men you and that she was slow and couldn't comprehend y'all just need to check this out one time we were in a meeting we were talking about beyonce he's like i had dinner with her a few weeks ago and we're like what? he's like do you guys want to know about beyonce and we're like oh, like we were almost foaming at the mouth we couldn't handle it this is what he said to me these are his words i'm just, these are his words he's like it was a group dinner and like some fancy place in new york i, I can't remember where he's like there were about 10 of us. He's like, and if I didn't know that was Beyonce, like Beyonce sitting across the table from me, I would think she was retarded. And the room was silent, pen drop. We were like, I'm sorry. Did you just say you would, what? <laughs> he's like, and he, again, these are, these are his, this is his retelling. He's like, um, she couldn't really read the menu. Like someone was like going over it with her, like it, and not just like, oh, what are you gonna get? Like they were going over it with her, like you would go over it with a, with a child. And then somebody else at the table, and this was all like, you know, her team, like editors, makeup artists, like it was a very, it wasn't like, she knew every single person at that table. And I guess he was there with somebody, whatever. Somebody had a chess set and they put it in a Prada bag and they were like giving it to, to somebody else, like a Prada shopping bag, like a paper shopping bag. And they're like, oh, thanks. And Beyonce's like, wait a minute. Prada makes a chess set? Why don't I have one? I'm like, oh no, 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 I just, I just put it in the bag. I just need to give him something. She's like, Prada makes a chess set and I don't have one. Why don't I have a Prada chess set? And they're like, no, it's, it's not a Prada chess set. It's a chess set. I just am using this bag to transport it. And she could not get it. She couldn't understand that. She couldn't understand what a bag does. Again, is his account. Now, many years ago, there were rumors going around that Beyonce never graduated high school. If y'all remember, Beyonce, Kelly Rowland, and Michelle Williams were in high school and performing on the side at fairs and private events. Now, Destiny's Child blew up and blew up quick. So, Beyonce was pulled out of school around the age of 15. So, she wasn't able to go to regular school and had to be homeschooled because of all the traveling and the crazy schedules. Now, Beyonce missed out on many things, but she did go back and get 
her GED. And this is something that she told many people she wanted to accomplish. Now fam, do I want to believe that our beloved Beyonce can't understand or comprehend a menu? No. We are talking about a woman that has traveled all over the world and experienced many cultures and languages. I personally just can't grasp the concept that she can't read or comprehend on that type of level for real. Now if it's true, I personally do not care honey because you know the queen bee hits that stage. Whew, child, I don't care if she can read or has someone else read for her because she can dance, move, and perform like no other y'all. And the queen shows out for real. And speaking of showing out, Beyonce has has officially announced her renaissance tour fam i'm so excited y'all and do y'all believe what this woman is saying do you believe what the bodyguard is saying or whatever he's saying he is let me know in the comments below all right trendsetters let me know how you feel what you think share your thoughts below babes trendsetters i've enjoyed spilling the tea with you remember to support one another show love y'all support your girl it's free it's trendsetter tea babes this is a new channel so hit the like button hit the like button hit the like button <laughs> i can't get over that but y'all come on hit that like button subscribe your girl is trying to get over a thousand subscribers to go live and continue to bring you some more trending hot tea so hit the subscribe button y'all come on support your girl trendsetters love you fam bye